All right, we're gonna be kicking it with Keith and James. Keith is a packaging manager and James is a technical writer. Their job is to make sure that very important medical devices get to their destination safely, effectively, and on time. Speaking of on time, we don't wanna keep them waiting. Let's go. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? How you? Good, how you good. Come on in. Hey, Juice. How you doing? Good, how are you? I'm excited. What is this room? Tell me a little bit about this room. So this is a user experience research lab, or EARL for short. Yeah. It simulates a hospital okay. where people get prepared for the surgeries and where all the um, devices are kept. So it's kind of like the like a practice facility. Yeah. Okay. Color is very important in our industry because that's how they identify the products that they're going to use. Okay. And you've been exposed to this too. You just don't know it. Okay. So for example, when you're in the grocery store, can you tell me which one is the peanut in there? Those. How'd you know that? Because it's yellow. Because it's yellow, <laughs> right? So your mind is short-circuited to create shortcuts. And one of those is color. So I don't have to spend time reading to identify. It can really save lives because people are in the hospital here. And if a doctor says, I need this, and you know it's the orange one, just a quick glance and you got it. And you're handing it to the doctor and the patient is getting it right away. Yeah. We design and develop packages to support our medical devices. Yeah. And that means we have to make sure that they can be sterilized and that they can be opened aseptically so that we don't introduce any harm into the body. Does this package hold tight? Uh, can it withstand being shaken while it's on an airplane or on a truck? And we have to prove that it can. It's a premium product. And then here are the devices inside a sealed pouch, and it's still nice and sterile so that we know it's absolutely clean for the patient. Do you want to try opening it up? Yeah, yeah. Now just rip it off? Yep, go ahead. Now see that seal had to be tight enough so that it stayed closed, but it also had to be weak enough so that a human can actually open yeah, it up, yeah. right? So as a kid, I had no idea that package engineering was a thing. But as a kid, I knew that I always wanted to be a leader. I've been loving it. Like I really do enjoy bringing that, that science and technology aspect to the people side of things yeah. and helping them reach their goals on, on the products. When I read as a child, it was almost all nonfiction. I wasn't big into novels or poetry. Uh, I liked reading books about science and about history. Because yeah. two of my loves when I was growing up was science and writing. Okay. And to be able to marry both of those is really lucky for me. Well, thank you guys for letting us come and hang out with you for a little bit and learn all the important things about packaging. Keep, I appreciate you guys. Thank you for your time. Thanks for coming yeah. in. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, don't, don't worry about me. I'm gonna take these M&Ms and then, you know what? I think I'm gonna take just the yellow ones. Just the yellow ones. <sighs> See y'all. I guess he's taking them. <laughs>